Just hours ago, a man accused of kidnapping and murdering his ex-girlfriend was booked in jail at the Pasadena Police Department. Fox 26's Randy Wallace joining us live from Pasadena with new details he learned from court documents. Randy. Yeah, Rashi. Now, Daniel Chacon was arrested last night at 1130 at the Laredo Port of Entry by uh, Customs and Border Patrol. Pasadena police and members of the Gulf Coast Violent Task Force brought him back here to face aggravated kidnapping charges. Those charges are expected to be upgraded to murder. She told everybody the same thing. Uh, something has to happen to me before they actually pay attention to me. Pasadena police say they were aware of the volatile relationship between 30-year-old Daniel Chacon and his ex-girlfriend, Myra Gutierrez. On September 1st, 2022, the suspect in this case actually called the Pasadena police. I'm reporting that the victim um, was driving a vehicle with their child intoxicated. Um, Officers got out there and investigated. They learned that she was not intoxicated. Police say Gutierrez told them Chacon had assaulted her with a gun, but no gun was found. Despite Gutierrez telling them she did not want to file charges, police say they still contacted the DA's office. These charging decisions by the DA's office have to be based on evidence to establish probable cause. And a significant factor in that is that the victims um, have ongoing conversations with investigators and we have to rely on uh, the victims for this evidence. Gutierrez and Chacon have a five-month-old baby together. Police say Chacon kidnapped Gutierrez when she went to the apartment they once shared on Monday to see the baby. Gutierrez was later found shot to death. Court documents state Chacon told his uncle, quote, I think I'm going to have to kill this girl. The system was so messed up that they, they gave him custody of the baby, knowing he had all these felonies and all these prior, you know, whatever, cases that he had. In 2012, Chacon pled guilty to a misdemeanor charge of assaulting a family member. Five years later, he pled guilty to a felony charge of assault of a family member, but that charge was downgraded to a misdemeanor. That victim also had children with Chacon. Gutierrez's son said his mother was there for anyone who needed help. Anything you want, she's right there. You can call her, she right there. Anything you want. She was always so helpful. But as far as Gutierrez's family is concerned, the criminal justice system was no help to her. Chacon is expected to appear in probable cause court tomorrow for the aggravated kidnapping charges. The murder charges are expected as the investigation continues. Reporting live from Pasadena, Randy Wallace, Fox 26 News.